Bingo! Oh, hey. I wonder... What's that over there? Uh, it, well, well, but there, botched intro. Hey there, guys. Luigi Vance here. Welcome back to another episode of Breath of the Wild. It's also funny when you think about it, cause like I think this is the exact path. Yeah, this is the exact path I took to get to the tower, and I somehow passed this, neglected this, did not see it. <laughs> I think it was the Korok seed. It's always the Korok's fault. Remember that it's always the Korok's fault. Anyways, if you're coming from last episode, uh, well, you're in for a fun one because I don't remember what happened last episode, but it was probably doom and gloom, but mostly doom. Also, I know Amiibo thing I normally start off the episode with, but like, give me like five seconds and then we'll get to it. All right, cool. Just let me collect all these mighty thistles. Thistles? I don't know how it's pronounced, but that's how I guess it's pronounced. Hi. Boy. Sweet boy. Please, listen to my story. Sure. I am the great fairy Kesa. This place was once a beautiful spring, but as time passed, fewer and fewer travelers arrived to offer me rupees. As a result, my powers abandoned me. I'm nearly powerless now, so I beg your help. I need rupees to become whole again. All I need is 1,000 rupees! <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't have a thousand rupees. That, that guy, that guy owes me 500 more rupees. I mean, it's expected because every great fairy you bring back, they get more and more pricey. So this is like, what, the third one? So, of course, it's a lot. Anyways, while I go get money, this episode is brought to you by Twilight Princess Zelda. And by that, I mean Super Smash Zelda. And by that, I mean Smash 4 Zelda. God, I, since Ultimates came out, I really need to think of how to title these things. <laughs> because it is the Smash Zelda, but it's not the current Smash Zelda. It is the Smash Zelda of old. Uh, I'm a... I'm a... I'm gonna go find some money. Where does this go? Is this an easy path back? Was this here the whole time? I've never come down here. Yeah. Again. I just ignored it. I'm gonna get money. I'll be right back. Hey, buddy. Did, did you know? I, I, I met the great fairy. Do you know how much money she demanded? 1,000 rupees. You gave me 500. You better, you better, you better, you better I don't have bomb arrows, but I can straighten you with ice arrows. No! Ah! Hey, thanks, Goron, brother. You did well reminding me that I have protection. Hey, I have your money. Yeah, here, take 1,000 rupees. 500 which from a guy I met who I may or may not have killed. <laughs> yep, I am the one. Oh, thank you. Way to boost my ego. Also, what? No, sorry, I got my own stuff to do. I'm not blushing, you are! What? Anyways. Now, that we have rescued a third great fairy, she will enhance our clothing and know their power. So, like... This soldier's armor, I can enhance even further. What's even more useful is that, um, remember how we were talking about earlier with the past two great fairies saying if we have a set of clothing, there will be an additional bonus 
If you have all three, hey, guess what? We could do that now. If you have the right enough materials, which I don't think I have enough materials for all of them. But yeah, now that's the thing. I should upgrade one of these tunics. I won't. Pr I will never use them unless it's the Twilight one, <laughs> which really I think it's the pants. Yeah, it's only the pants. <laughs> but yeah, we can do that now. Um, I should probably upgrade some of these, but I only have one of each material for some reason. What about my current? What about my main armor? Sure, let's do that. Let's enhance my main armor. I forgot what I need to upgrade a champion's tunic. Also, I, f I shouldn't have skipped it. This is like a new cutscene for when you get third gear armor. Whoops. <laughs> Whoops. Sorry, I'm just used to mashing X. Oh yeah, I need Shard of Ferocious Horn. <laughs> I need a lot of those. Um, what else is... These are currently two, right? Uh, sure. No, wait. Let's enhance the pants. Because the pants are more important than the armor! <laughs> Cover your eyes, Link. It's gonna get dirty real fast. I mean, what? No, I'm good. Well, I mean, yeah, there's like one more of you I need to find. Which is somewhere in this world. Alright, cool. Oh, great. The quest has been updated. Look, I've already went back and forth. If I decide or care, I'll go back to the guy I murdered. I mean, may or may not have murdered. And then we'll continue to talk about the reward and junk. But, like... Yeah. Actually, you know what? Let me go do that right now. Because I'm going to forget about it. <laughs> it's going to be a lot more uh, jump cutting today. <laughs> Last episode was the climbing episode. This is a jump cutting episode. <laughs> it's fun. Why am I just floating? Hey, buddy, how's it going? Sorry I murdered your face. But yes, I gave her an offering. <laughs> y yeah, sure. <laughs> I mean, it's not that bad. It's not like you have to climb a lot. <laughs> You're forgetting something. Yes, I do want a reward. Yes, I'm asking for more because I had to pay for more! <sighs> Alright. Give me my money! All right, um, I decided to come back to the tower because I thought it would be like an easy way to tell where I should go. I think I just need to go down this path, right? Yeah, just follow the trail and y you'll be led to wherever it is you need to be. Sure, let's ju let's just do that and forget that I tried to, uh, you know, murder a man twice. But he deserves it, man. D doesn't he know how far I had to go? I mean, the stable's right there, the spring is right here, it's sure it's secluded, but like, for crying out loud, dude. A nice reward would have been nice. <laughs> a nice reward would have been nice. Yep. Hey, any, any bokoblins there? Because I would love to blow them up. No? There's no one here? Oh, it's Lizalfos. You know what? That's even better. Um, sure. Why don't I also equip some better armor? <laughs> or at least armor that I can handle. Sure. And just for giggles. Hi, how are you? Yeah, oh no, my sword broke. It's okay. No, I don't want to use flame blade. Uh, get out of here. Hi. Get out of here. Give me your swords. Give me... Oh, I can't carry more of that. Well, fine, whatever. Oh, you're dead already. Oh, feathered spear. God, everything is weak around here. Nothing is strong. 
Then again, that tells you that we're in a new region because we are now getting into this region's weapons, I guess. Can I climb up here? I can't. Do I have to literally climb a tree? I guess I have to literally climb, climb a tree. All right, let's climb this tree and see where it takes us because I want to know what's up here. There's a chest there. Let's get to the top <laughs> and jump. And I did it. What is my reward? It's something garbage, probably. Arrows. All right, I'll take. <laughs> the more arrows I get, the better. What is this? Oh, the rusty halberd? Nah. Rusty claymore? Nah. <laughs> Any rupees in here? I had to. I had to literally destroy like three thousand my rupees. Ah, oh, there's only an amp. Fine. I'll take the apple, but I won't like it. Alright, I'm gonna fucking bring pants over here. Because pants needs to be here, and I deserve my pants. Alright, pants, let's go. We got wolves after us. <laughs> Run! Gallop! Do something! There's a small rickety bridge. Is there anything down there? Well, there's a Lizalfos down there. Eating some bugs, probably. But well, is there something else? Wait a minute. Hold on. Oh, I thought I saw... <laughs> I thought I saw something that looks remotely like a Korok seed, but I guess I was wrong. I can't tell anyways because of the angles. Yeah, no, there's a bunch of Lizalfos down there. And wolves. Just chilling. Having a time of their life. It's also very windy. Alright, Pants, let's just keep going. I don't like being on this bridge and I already lost you once. I don't want to lose you again! Oh! I did not mean to press this button. You know what? Games that use the X button for menus has completely ruined me. <laughs> because I keep thinking... Oh yeah, X is to open up the menu. No, JK, it's it's really start. I, I also need to hurry on through because apparently there are enemies here and I wasn't aware of it. Hey, what's up, nerd? Bye, nerd. Beep, beep, I'm a jeep. Son of a bitch. Where is he? Ugh. Well, you won't just let me go. You had to literally be in my way. And make pants run into a wall. Listen, I have trust issues. Ever since I lost pants, I can't afford to lose him again. You know how hard it is to find another horse? It's very hard. Especially one like pants. Especially one like pants. Also, shouldn't there be a, a shrine somewhere? Because, hey, look, it's another stable. The Rito stable. Oh, uh, I feel like there should be a shrine. <laughs> is the shrine sensor on or is it off? No, it's on. Okay. It's just I haven't detected. Okay, I've just weirded out. Hey, Birdman. Ah, we meet again. I'm glad to see you in one piece. We're actually very close to my hometown of Rito Village. And I must admit, I'm feeling incredibly homesick. I had to leave my wife and children back in the village. I'm sure they're doing just fine. But you see... I cannot go go home until I fulfill my promise to my teacher. Promise? My promise to... Uh, on second thought, now is not the time. But if I am able to learn all of the ancient songs, I will tell you about my promise back in my hometown. But listen to me blather on. I need to focus on my craft. Nah, I've already heard it, but thanks. Uh, so, by the way, there's your incentive to do all the random shrine quests that Cass has. Which, if I remember right, I think I, I've i done all of them but one or two. I'm trying to remember, and I know I just recorded, um, uh, not just recorded, but I recorded last episode, like, a week or so ago. Hi, how are you? Thing about me is I can't just let go of spice in my life. Spicy! I need that burning tangle. I need curry rice. Now, I have Hylian rice on hand, which I need to make curry rice, but I'm out fresh out of Goron spice. I can't just run off and leave the stable. If you happen to get your hands on some Goron spice, can you give it to me? Yeah, sure, old man. Thank you, shiny, shiny boy. 
Curry Rice always warms me up. Let's see how long it takes until I forget this voice. Hi, how are you? <laughs> My guy, you're here to do the thing, right? <laughs> the thing? Come on, you know. The thing! Climbing the snowy mountains! I was confident I could handle the cold, so I didn't wear anything special, but the Herba Mountains are really cold. Like, seriously cold. Cold enough to send you to your grave, I'd say. So be careful out there, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Which, by the way, I, I, I know I, I shouldn't be spoiling things, but this this is the mountain range. Th this, is, this was also one of the options I was considering, but I realized I don't have the right gear for it. Uh, what is this? Oh, Rumor Mill. Ah, my favorite, uh, gossip magazine. The Sword of Seals of Darkness? Oh yeah, I have that. It, it's been found. Hit <laughs> one star out of five, because it's only for the hero. <laughs> well. Alright, uh, there's nothing else here. You are also a... <laughs> do you need a bed? Yes, I do. Cool. Um... Oh, I would have thought there would be a shrine here, but I guess not. I guess it makes sense they wouldn't put one here. Especially since everything is so close to each other. Like, jeez. Uh, is there anything else? I oh, bundles of wood! I need that for that one guy! You know, what's his name? Uh, uh um, uh, it's not, it, Hudson! There, there you go. I remember the name now. <laughs> Woodcutter's axe, huh? I better remember that. Oh, look, wild berries. They're, they, they're just food. Speaking of food. Speaking of food, how am I doing with cooked? Oh, I, I have plenty of things. <laughs> I have plenty of food. I'm fine. All right, enough horsing around. No no pun intended. Or maybe. Oh, no. Let's just, let's finally head on to, to the village. Pants, I could just leave you here, but <laughs> I'm gonna take you across a perilous bridge. Hey, what's up, my dude? Yeah. Good day. Do you need something? Who are you? I'm pressing X again. I am just saying of Dorito. Dorito? Yes. Dorito of Lake Totori, where the men are fine, where the men are fine archers and the women better singers. You being a Hylian, I'm surprised you haven't heard that before. You should visit the village if you get the chance. Well, I'm on my way, so... Just, just don't mind me and my horse. <laughs> Whee! So there's a shrine nearby. Yeah, I kind of figured why. <laughs> Man, I wonder where the shrine is! Guys, pants. 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 Where are you going now? <laughs> you know what? Fine. You stay here, I'll just walk the rest of the way. It's fine. It's fine, Pants. You just don't... Don't walk off the cliff or anything. You'll be fine. If I need you, I can just call you and you'll warp over to me. It's simple as that. Uh, Pants. Speaking of quests, I need to activate the main one. Um, there you go, because I need to know where the hell I'm going. Oh, this episode, what is it? What even is this video? Is there any fish here? I know you can find, yeah, there's some fish here. Give me that hearty salmon. I think that can raise my heart. If I do it right. Which I think I hope I did. So, 
the divine beast has just been floating around well not floating but like flying around the village since day one huh all right cool let's just let's go without my pants ah welcome to Rito village where the music is great and everything is slow hmm are you a traveler I like to show you around but now's not really a good time well tell me where am I this is a real village, but, well, you could say we're not in a welcoming mood. Talk to the folks in the village to hear all about it. Any other questions? Well, what's going on? Oh, we're looking at the sky. Did you see that beast in the sky? That's the Vine Beast Von Meadow. It showed up a while back. The Rito warriors who flew up to check it out were shot down. They say it used to be a divine being that protected the village, but it doesn't seem very divine to me. Thankfully, the, the thing only shoots at anything flying high above the village. But still, it's pretty demoralizing for us Rito to have to fly so low to the ground. Any other questions? Nah, I'm good now. So, that's the main threat. <laughs> Dorito can't fly without being shot down. That's sad. Well, anyways, as much as I like to talk to people. Oh, hey, shrine! Do I have enough? Oh, what do I want? I have enough for like three. Um, you know what? Let's get, let's do one stamina and then um two hearts. That would be great. At least it will give me something. Something of a decent upgrade. Oh yeah. Oh, we're almost to a full second bar too. Uh, and I guess, yeah, heart container. So will this give me a second roll of hearts, or is this the last one? I'm trying to remember, because I think you have 10 hearts, or 20 hearts, and then you move on to a second row. I don't know, we're about to find out. Oh yeah, no, there you go. <laughs> We're now starting our second row of hearts. Finally, after like, what, 60 episodes? Yeah. What's up, my dude? Hey, what's up? So, you, have you seen it? Divine Beast Von Meadow? Yeah, I saw it. Everyone in the village is freaking out because of it, but I have bigger problems. My mom is so annoying. She asks me to help out at the store every single day. I can't take it anymore. I don't want to just help. I want to open my own store and sell whatever I want. Well, buddy. Maybe there's a village somewhere worthy of your dreams. I'll keep an ear out. <laughs> ear out? Eye out? Whatever. Hi. This is the inn. <laughs> Troubles. Haven't you seen it? Oh, yeah, the Divine Beast. Yeah. Want more details? Talk to you, the Elder. All right, cool. Um, Yeah, let's just do that. But first, I, there's shops around here. Hi, what do you sell? Oh yeah, isn't this like a, yeah, it's a recipe book where you can make some whatever you want. <laughs> make some whatever you want. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. What arrows do you have? <gasps> you have bomb arrows. Well, I'll just be buying those whenever I'm ready. <laughs> when I don't, when I'm not in struggling debt from rupees. Uh, let's see what other things are around here because like every new village there are armors and stuff like this Conveniently placed Gear made for the cold thousand rupees I'm gonna buy the tunic and then if I need all three I'll buy all three But uh, yeah, thanks for even more crippling debt. Hi, excuse me Did not mean to talk to you, but actually no idea someplace cold. Yeah, Cool, bye. <laughs> Alright, let's just make our way to the top of the village. I mean, there's a lot of people to talk to and junk, but like, they're all gonna say the same thing. Divine Beast has shown up! Oh no! Hey, your request. Want me to tell you a story? Yeah, sure, I love stories. Awesome, me too. Ahem. <clears throat> Once upon a time, my grandpa stopped at a big tree while he was climbing a big mountain and looked below him to the northwest. 
when suddenly he saw a huge snow white birdie with his wings spread wide. My grandpa took off flying after the snow white birdie. And as he got a little closer to the white birdie, grandpa saw something super important inside his belly. The birdie has swallowed. Well, what is it? I always get to sleep around that part of the story, so I don't remember. Oh, I know where the big tree is, though. It's over there. Do you see it? Grandpa said he saw the Snow White birdie from that tree. Hmm. <laughs> now, what did that Snow White birdie swallow? I can't hear the story from Grandpa anymore. <laughs> oh, Grandpa's dead. But that's the Shrine Quest. Can I? I don't have any markers. I forgot I used up all my markers to mark shrines that I probably won't visit until a later date. Speaking of which, isn't this one marked? No, I unmarked this one. I forgot where I marked the others. Ah, oh, let's get this shrine first. Also, hi. Keel, why you must always insist on worrying your poor mother? What's the matter? My youngest daughter, Keel, wants to go to Warbler's Nest. She won't stop talking about it. I have five daughters, and ever since that beast appeared, they, they have been getting needier by the minute. At times like this, I wish he was around. I wish I could be a kid again and think only of myself. But that is the thing about being a parent. You have, big, you have to be bigger than your children. <laughs> it is a big jerk! What? <laughs> Language! No, no, it's okay. Jerks is acceptable. <laughs> You just can't say the other thing. Uh, that's something we'll have to deal with later. I also didn't mean to swing out my sword. I meant to just jump. I don't know how I keep pressing Y. This is what happens when I st when I stop playing this game for like a week and like play other games. It also doesn't help that I have a pro controller right now instead of the regular Joy Cons. Oh, great, it's wind! Oh, I have to figure this out. What's over here? This looks suspicious. That's a thing. Can I shoot it? Let's not waste arrows. Let's, wa let's waste the other thing. Um, I can't throw this. It's not very high. Yeah, maybe I'll figure that out later. Maybe one of these will actually control the, um... Uh, this section. What's over here? Oh, uh, this is for a chest. Oh, yeah! There you go! <laughs> We're getting into treasure chest immediately. Screw the other puzzle. Hooray! I did it! I solved the puzzle. I did it. I can go home now. <laughs> Screw the other place. No, I have to solve the puzzle. There's nothing else here, is there? Oh my god, there is. Oh. Dang. I, I thought I was kidding when I said there was something else, but I guess I was wrong. Alright, hold on. Let me get my cryonist out and then we'll just do the thing. Maybe it will be easier if the wind wasn't blowing. Yeah, you're right. Too bad I won't listen to myself. Alright, what's in here? Sapphire. Hey, more selling fodder. I'm gonna need a lot more. Give me like 10 more sapphires and then we'll talk. Alright, and this one is... A feathered spear with durability up. Um, I want to take it just because. Here, we'll get rid of you. <laughs> Even though you also have durability up. Uh, let's just get rid of you. Alright, cool. Oh, there I go. And let's climb this. Alright, now let's... <laughs> let's actually solve this puzzle. I think what I'm supposed to do is have all these, um fans spinning at the same time so what we're gonna have to do oh yeah these these go a direction 
So we'll just do that. We'll get this going. Or this one. Um. Oh boy. <laughs> I actually have to think about this for a bit. Hold on. So we get these going. So the only one that needs to be changed is one of you. <laughs> Maybe you in particular, because you aren't facing the right direction. But then how do I get this? Ah, <laughs> oh, the puzzles! I almost have this, hold on. I'll figure it out. Um... Something, something, something. I'm missing something. Alright, how about we do this? That will get that going. Then this will get going. But then what about these? Ah! Puzzles! How do you do? Especially if it's wind. Well, technically, I don't need you blowing on this side. So that's all of them but this. So I'm missing something. I'm clearly missing something. Hold on. Because all of them were in place but one. Can I cheap this out? <laughs> I'm wondering. No! They know! They know! Wait. Yeah, I was about to say, it's not going to stay open. It needs a constant flow of wind. Ooh, can I cry on? That's cryostasis, is this? I can, but I don't think that's that's going to help either. Um... <laughs> Damn you, wind puzzles! I'll figure you out. I just need to figure out what I don't need. I figured it out. It was as simple as one of these things doesn't need to be blown on the same direction. So, yeah, I, I was right. <laughs> At least I figured it out instead of later when it's too late. Whoops, I missed my mark. Hold on, I gotta go back up the stairs and press the A and not the X. Ah, oh, give me the thing. Yeah, I know. Courageous made a god to smile upon you. Blah, blah, blah. Alright. Cool. So that's that. <laughs> and I'm gonna call this an episode. Yeah, I would continue, but like... Our next goal is to meet with the village chief and it's gonna trigger a cutscene and this the video is already long enough already so I think now's a good time to stop so if you like what you see here then slap that like button really like what you see here then slap the subscribe button you won't regret it and if you do blame yourself for listening to me and next time plot we're finally moving on with plot I can't believe it, it it's, it's happening it's finally happening <laughs>